So the left window is admin panel and right window is user side. You have to send the event from do delete function. Create an instance of socket and send the event. The name of socket event should be delete post and send the post ID as a parameter. Attach the same listener on server.js. Broadcast will send the event to all users except the admin. If you want to show a confirm box, so that before deleting post it should ask for confirmation. You can use the built-in JavaScript confirm function. Wrap the complete function inside this, if statement. Now attach the listener on user home page. We will be giving each post a unique ID and calling the remove function will delete that layout. Now test it. In next tutorial, which will be the last tutorial of this series, we will be adding a settings feature. So admin can manage multiple settings of website.